Okay, well, I started a toy company called Heroes in Action Toys, and what prompted me to start the company was was Migos, pretty much. Um, you know, the, the, the Migo 8-inch superheroes were my number one favorite toys. That's what I really... I mean, I, when I started collecting toys, I collected Star Wars and all kinds of stuff, but I came back to my, you know, to what's dearest in my heart, and that was Migos. And that's really my main thing I collect, is the 8-inch superheroes. I collect Sesame Street and some other things, but really most superhero Migo stuff on Planet of the Apes was the main thing that I collected, and the 8-inch figures by far were my best and most favorite. So when I started a toy company, I had to make 8-inch figures. I had to make 8-inch figures with removable clothing. I had to be, you know, like this. no matter what, I had to do that because that was within my heart. So um, actually, um, my friend Lev and I, we started a, a company, I think, in 2009, and we made a President Obama action figure. And um, which a lot of people don't actually know, originally the body for that... Um, President Obama figure was actually something I was trying to do with DC Direct. So the body actually was going to be a kind of superhero type thing. And then I ended up using it for Obama. So that's why he's kind of a little muscular. If you look at him, actually we had to tone him down a little. He's still kind of cut. But uh, So that was the first figure we did. And then I made an Abraham Lincoln. And my friend Scott Adams actually liked the Lincoln so much. He was talking about I should do a disco Lincoln and a pimp Lincoln. And... Uh, and the uh, Lincolnstein, he sent to me an email on it. And when I saw the name Lincolnstein, I had like a little bit of a chill. And I'm like, gosh, that name is great. And I called my attorney and I could hear him typing in the computer. And he's like, it's available. Get me a logo, get me some artwork, we're gonna trademark it and copyright it. So the next thing you know, we trademarked the name, we copyrighted the likeness, we submitted all the art and and uh, we created Lincolnstein. And then a friend of mine met me at uh, San Diego and he took it into a meeting with Toys R Us and Toys R Us said, uh, they said, if you can come up with a series, if you can give us at least three to four characters, we will carry this. So then he goes, Mark, you have to hurry up and come up with three to four characters. So within that San Diego to the following San Diego, so from, so from July to the next July, I had seven figures packaged on and, mass and, and produced. And it's probably the fastest I've ever been on anything. I'm usually a procrastinator on stuff, but I knew I had deadlines on that. And that's what started. And now this, actually this year we just got the license for Mars Attacks and I got my first official license. So we're going to be doing 8-inch uh, figures of Mars Attacks and we're actually doing 4-inch ones. I'm doing mini figures where I'm taking the heads from the 8-inch figures and putting them on little mini bodies and doing kind of like a kind of cutesy character style. What's the future of Presidential Monsters? Uh, the future of Presidential Monsters hopefully is a long, vast, monstrous future. Um, we, we've been working on, uh, we actually have 29 characters in the works. Um, I'm actually talking, we're trying to actually expand it as, as an IP uh, to do other products and license it out. So we're, we're really got, I don't know if I could talk about a lot of the things we're working on, but we've got a couple major uh, projects in the works, which hopefully is going to keep going and everything will be good. But uh, we're, we're going to keep continuing. We're expanding. We're not just doing the, the U.S. You know, we're not just doing presidents. We're doing politicians. So the ones that could have been, would have been, should have been, wanted to be. Uh, we're also doing, uh, we're going to Europe. We're, uh, we're going all around. So uh, it's, it's kind of exciting. I'm looking forward to it.